Hey guys, welcome back. I am back from my vacation and I'm so glad to be back. I had couponing withdrawal. Just asked my husband because I said I was not going to coupon even though he said I could. I, I looked at some videos when I had some downtime and Instagram and stuff like that, but I stuck to my guns and no couponing. But today is May 3rd and we have that spend 20, get 7,000 bonus, 7,000 points bonus perk on our Walgreens card. And I'm gonna do my first transaction today. So let's get started. Now I am over by the Walgreens brand lotion because Walgreens sent me a bonus perk to my card. If I buy one Walgreens brand lotion, I would get 5,000 points. I did not know they were only $4 and they come in a variety of scents. So I'm gonna try the Pear Blossom, this one right here for $4 and I'll get back 5,000 points. There's no coupons for that, but I don't need that because I get back $5 and I'm only spending four because 5,000 points is equivalent to $5. Now the next thing I'm going to pick up is the Revlon Lip Care, the Moisture Rich Smooth Gel Color. No particular reason, but because Walgreens has given me another bonus perk, if I buy any Revlon Cosmetic, I get 3,000 points. So I'm going to go ahead and pick that up. And I'll use this $3 off of one Revlon coupon. I'm not sure which insert that came out of, but... All of the Revlon cosmetics are 40% off. So it's $4.97, take off $3. And after the coupon, I'll pay $1.97 out of pocket and get back 3,000 points. Bonus perk that was given to me the by next Walgreens. Thing I'm gonna pick up is this Chic Quattro Raspberry Rain. It is on sale for $5.99. And I have a $4 digital coupon that will go with that making that $1.99 after the coupon. Remember with the spend 20, get 7,000 points. You cannot use points to get points. And you, so you have to use cash or register rewards to lower your out of pocket. You must get to $20 before coupons. Sorry guys, I forgot to mention, I have a $4 off of one ship internet printable coupon the reason why I brought those is just in case the digitals don't come off I am prepared with my printable coupons I just want this to go as smooth as possible the next thing I'm going to pick up is the big Soleil balance because we have a four dollar off coupon internet printable from coupons.com they're on sale this week for $5.99 with the coupon that'll leave me $1.99 to pay after the coupon and the sale price. So this is everything I'm gonna get for the spend 20, get 7,000 points on beauty and personal care, which I didn't mention. But like before, you can only use registry rewards and cash and coupons to lower your out of pocket. I'm picking up the Big Sole Balance. It's on sale $5.99 and I have the $4 coupon, the Chic. I have the $4 coupon and it's $5.99 and I also get 2,000 points for buying that. I have a bonus perk on my card for that I didn't mention. I have a bonus perk for 3,000 points for the Revlon. That's why I'm buying that. And I have a bonus perk for the lotion. That's why I'm buying that. My total is $20.95 before coupons. These are all the points that I received after coupons, which my coupons came to $11. I paid $9.95. And I'll get back 15,000 points, 7,000 for spending 20, 5,000 for the lotion, 3,000 for the Revlon, and 2,000 for the Chic. If for any reason I don't get the points, I'll just call up Walgreens and get my points added. It's no big deal because uh, it wouldn't deduct anything from the total, so I don't mind calling them and getting that added on later. I did do the Oil of Olay deal. I did that earlier. I did that purchase with a 5 off of 15. When you buy 4, there are 2 for 10 and you'll get the 4,000, I'm sorry, 2,000 points after the purchase. So my subtotal was $6 after the $9 coupon off of 4 Olay products or Old Spice products. 
the five dollars came off for the five off of 15 that left me with six dollars i paid a dollar 13 tax i used five thousand points my subtotal was 713 that left me with two dollars and 13 cents to pay out of pocket for that purchase that was my first purchase and this will be my second purchase for the spend 20 get 7,000 points i just didn't want to mix though that five off of 15 because that is also a spin deal it's spin 15 get 5,000 points and I didn't I wasn't sure how that would work or I didn't want any problems I just want smooth transactions I don't want to you know go back and recalculate because I did something wrong just want smooth transactions so this is it okay guys I am all finished and everything worked out perfectly I had no problems um, my total before t after, I was off a little bit on my math, I guess, but my subtotal was 1037 after tax was 1213. That's what I paid out of pocket. I got back 23,000 points. You can see right there 7,000 7, points for spending 20. I reached my beauty threshold, they gave me 5,000 points for that. I got 5,000 points back for the lotion. 3,000 back for the Revlon, 2,000 points back for the, what was that, one of the razors, the Chic, and I even had a three, spend 15, get 3,000 points on my card, that came off too, go figure, but I'm not complaining, uh, look what I got you guys, so start looking for that, spend 25, get 7,000 points, it printed, I have until the 9th to use that. So I guess it'll work out great for Sunday. I just hate these because you spend, we spend so much cash and we don't have like a lot of registry rewards to go with that. Except that one for the candy and I haven't done that deal this week. I'll try to do it before the end of the week though. It's hard. It's like trying to play catch up when you go on vacation. But my transaction worked out a little better because I hadn't calculated the 5,000 points or that the spend 15 get 3,000 points because they usually don't go together. But anyway, I am happy, and I'll probably see you guys tomorrow. I'm going to do another deal on my husband's card. This was my card, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.